Hey guys, I hope you guys are doing well, staying healthy and staying active. Uh, my name is Michael and today I will be leading your warm up. So right now we're going to go ahead and start with just our marches. So we're going to go ahead and start marching in place here. With our marches, remember we are trying to keep our back straight, keep our chin up and focus on making sure we are breathing in and out here. With our marches today, we'll go, go ahead and add in some bicep curls as well. So let's go ahead and add in some bicep curls. Nice guys, keep it up. All right, so from our bicep curls here in a few seconds, we are going to move into our march. I mean, not a march, but into our, our side steps. All right, ready? Three. Two and one. Let's go ahead and go into our side steps here. Nice guys. So with our side steps, we are also going to add in a tricep uh, stretch as well. So we're going to take one arm, reach it behind our backs here and behind our head. We're going to take the other arm. Go ahead, go ahead and grab that tricep. Remember, remember, we are not going to grab right on the elbow, but on the tricep. And then we're going to go ahead and pull, and we, we will create a stretch. Awesome, guys. All right, so from here, we're going to go ahead and switch into your other side, doing that tricep stretch on that other arm. Awesome, guys. Still doing those side steps. Awesome. Here, in a couple seconds, we're going to go ahead and move back into our march. All right? Five, four, three, two, and let's go ahead and go back to, into our march this time. So, from our march, we are also going to go cross our arm, across our, take our arm, cross it across our body, to the other arm, and go ahead and grab it right on the shoulders and then pull in, as if you were hugging yourself. Awesome, guys. So I'm from here. We're gonna hold for a couple more seconds and then we'll do it on the other arm. All right, ready? Three, two, and let's go ahead and switch that other arm this time. Nice, guys. Hold for a couple more seconds here. And then we will move back into our march again. So ready? Three, two, and into our side steps. Alrighty, three, two, and let's go ahead and go into our side steps here. So from our side steps, we are going to do some shoulder rolls. We're going to go ahead and roll our shoulders back. Nice. Keep it up. Roll those shoulders. Good. Let's do three more shoulder rolls. One, three, two, and one. We're going to still do the side steps, but now we're going to go ahead and do our shoulder rolls the other direction. So start your shoulder rolls going into that opposite direction that you just did. Nice guys, five more shoulder rolls, four, three, two, and one. Awesome. So from here, we're going to go back to into our march again. From our march, we're going to add in a torso twist. So we're going to go ahead and bring both hands out, lace them together. We're going to go ahead and pull all the way to one side, hold, pull back to center. Pull to the other side, hold for a second, and return back to center. So we'll keep doing those with our marches here. And if we need to decrease intensity for our torso twist, instead of having our arms out, we can just have them right by our sides. We're gonna just turn our body, hold, and then return to center. Turn our body again, hold, and then return to center. So we'll keep doing that. 
Nice. Let's do two more torso twists here. Two. One more here. And one. Awesome. So from now we're going to go ahead and go into our squats. Remember when we are doing our squats, we want our shoulder, we want our feet to be shoulder width apart. And when we squat, we want to keep our back straight and we're all you guys squat to a 90. And then come up. So to a 90, and then we're gonna come right back up here. Trying to keep our back straight, keep our head up. Awesome guys, you guys are doing good. Keep it up. We're gonna do five more here. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Awesome, guys. So from here, we're gonna make our way to our hands and our knees. So from our hands and our knees, we're gonna have them both shoulder width apart. We're gonna start with our cat cows. So hands, knees, shoulder width apart, starting with cat cows. We're going to arch our back all the way up, hold, and we're going to bring it all the way down. Hold, all the way up, and all the way down. Good. Remember, remember to, uh, to breathe as you guys are doing, doing your exercises here. Good, guys. You guys are looking good. Keep it up. All the way to the top, and all the way down. All right, let's do three more. Three. Two. And one. Awesome. We're gonna go ahead and from our hands and knees, we're gonna come to our side this time. You, can, we're gonna, you guys can use your arm as a pillow. Go ahead and lay right on your side, and we're gonna do some leg raises. So let's do some leg raises here. Trying to keep our leg up as straight as possible, and keep our back straight. Good guys, keep it up. Good. All right, let's do five more here. Four. Three. Two and one. Awesome. So you're gonna take that leg that you just did your leg raises with. Go ahead and place it right in front, and we're gonna go ahead and do leg raises on that back leg this time. So leg up and down. Raise all the way up and bring it all the way down. Good guys. You guys are doing good, looking good. Bring it all the way to the top and all the way down. Ready? Three, two, and one. Awesome, guys. Well, we're going to go ahead and switch to the other side this time. Go into our leg raises. All right, ready? Go ahead and do your leg raises. Keep them as straight as possible. Use your arm as a pillow. Nice guys, keep it up. All right, five, four, three, two, and one. Just like on the on our other side, we're gonna go ahead and take that leg that we did leg raises with, place it in front, and we're gonna do leg raises on the back leg this time. Nice guys, raise it all the way to the top and bring it down. If you guys want to increase intensity, we can ra raise the leg, hold for a second, and then bring it down. All the way up, hold, and bring it all the way down. Three, two, and one. Awesome guys. So from here, we go got to lay on our backs this time. From our backs, we're gonna go ahead and bring one leg up. Go ahead and cross it across. Take it and lay it across your body. As we are doing this stretch, we're gonna try to keep both shoulder blades on the ground. So try not to bring one shoulder blade up, 
by keeping them both down on the ground. All right. Awesome. We're going to hold five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome, guys. So we're going to go ahead and um, bring that leg back and extend that other leg and reach it across that body. Just like before, try to keep both shoulder blades on the ground. Looking good, guys. Keep holding. Three, two, and one. Awesome, guys. Go ahead and make your way up to a sitting position. So from here, we're going to go ahead and reach one leg out, one leg in, and we're going to go ahead and reach for the leg, the ankles, or the toes here. Go ahead and reach to one of those three spots here. And we're going to hold that stretch. You guys are doing good. We're almost there. Three, two, and one. We're going to switch to the other side. Extend that other leg and bring that other foot in. So reach for your foot here. And then we're going to hold. As you guys are holding, make sure we're, we are breathing as well. Five, four, Three, two, and one. All right, awesome. So we're gonna go ahead and bring both feet together and go into our butterfly stretch here. So when you guys are doing this, you guys are trying to focus on uh, pushing both knees to the ground or until you guys are able to feel a stretch. So go ahead, get into your butterfly and then feel that stretch. As we do this stretch, we want to keep our back straight. Nice. Keep holding. Five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome, guys. So from here, we're going to go ahead and make our way back to a standing position. So from standing, we're going to... so from our standing, we're going to go ahead and do some calf raises here. So from here, we're going to go ahead and do some calf raises. Going up and down. Remember, keep our feet shoulder width apart, and we're gonna go and go all the way up to our toes here. If you guys need to increase intensity, you guys can go ahead and do calf raise, hold for a second at the top, and then bring it down. All the way to the top, and then bring it down. Nice guys, keep it up. All right, let's do five more here. Five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome, guys. So we're gonna finish off with some cardio. We're gonna start with our jumping jacks, then we'll move right into our side steps. So from our jumping jacks, we're gonna go all the way up. If you guys need to decrease intensity, you guys can go ahead and go side step out, move your arms, and do a side step if we need to decrease intensity here. But we're gonna go ahead and start with our jumping jacks, starting pretty slow first, and then we're gonna increase speed as we go on. Awesome, guys. Let's go ahead and increase the speed here. Get our hearts uh, going. All right, just a little bit faster, guys. Good. Good. All right, ready? Fast as we can, just for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome. Let's go ahead and go into our side steps. So I'm pretty slow first, and we'll, we'll increase the speed as we go on. So let's go ahead and go a little bit faster with our side steps. Awesome guys, keep it up, we're almost done. All right, just a little bit faster. Good, and then as fast as we can, just for 10 seconds. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, we're almost there. Three, 
two, and one. Awesome guys, so that concludes the warm up for today. I hope you guys are all doing well out there. Stay healthy, stay active, and until then, I'll see you guys next time. I hate.